out of your yard, uh, any kind of uh, tree debris, limbs, grass, uh, uh, tree trimmings, anything like that. Uh, tree limbs, we ask that they be placed out at the curb, uh, length no longer than four foot. Uh, all the, the, the residents are, are in, entitled to a free cord, which is a four foot by four foot by eight foot pile. We'll pick up at no charge. Anything over that size limit, there is charges involved with it. Um, if they have a pile out, they can call our office and we'll be glad to come out and check the pile and let them know if there is charges involved or not. Uh, and the, the charges are $20 per cord. Uh, every, every cord over the first cord is $20 per cord. We do ask that it's placed out at the curb, behind the curb, no further than six foot from the back of the curb. Just keep it at least three foot away from any kind of power lines, uh, power poles, uh, telephone pedestals, any, anything like that. Uh, it needs to be three foot away. So it's very important to keep the debris off the streets because when it's in the streets, uh, we get rain, it washes down into the storm drains and then we, it causes flooding throughout the city. We ask that the, the grass clipping leaves and things like that, the smaller items be placed inside the brown paper compost bags, uh, or they can use the regular 32-gallon uh, garbage cans. Uh, we do ask that it's not placed inside the city's uh, big 96-gallon rollouts, and also do not place it inside the recycling containers if it is. Yes, we have a, a dialer truck program, uh, which is uh, trucks that we use here in the city throughout the day, and then we take the trucks out. We usually park them between 2 and 4 in the afternoons, and the, the resident can use this truck at no charge uh, to, uh, to the resident. Uh, the truck can be got for large cleanup uh, trees, uh, tree limbs, yard waste. Uh, it can also be used for construction material, but this, this program is for residents only. Uh, and, uh, you know, we do ask that the debris not be mixed with uh, build material, yard waste, and things like that. It not be mixed. It, it all has to be separated. Uh, for more, more, more information on that, they can call our office and we can help them with that some.